On this problem, we're looking at factoring the trinomial. And when we go to factor, we're really kind of looking at the first term and the last term, or the a squared term and the b squared term. So if I want to set this up, right, if I have something a times something a, I want that to be 3a squared. So 3 is prime, so the factors are 1 and 3. And then this negative tells me I have one positive and one negative, but the negative one is larger. Because what I want here is this 20b squared. I'm looking for factors of 20b squared, which could be 2 and 10, or it could be 5 and 4. And I can play around with this. One of them is going to be positive, and one's going to be negative, but the larger factor is going to be negative. So I could try like 2 and 10. So I could have minus 10b plus 2b. And then when I FOIL that out, right, I have 3a squared plus 2 times 3. So 2 times 3 is 6ab minus 10ab minus 20b squared, right? So I set this up so that my first term and my last term were going to be what they needed. And then the middle term turns out to be minus 4ab, which is what I need. So with this first term being 3a, I got to do a little bit more consideration of what's going on here. But there's only a few different possibilities for the multiples of 20, either 2 and 10 or 5 and 4. And you could have tried 5 and 4 and seen that doesn't work. So this factors here as 3a minus 10b times 1a plus 2b. And you don't have to write the 1. You could have 3a minus 10b times a plus 2b.